Hi everyone, Zach here, and today we're going to be looking at the Prome Air Filter and HEPA Filter. If you guys wanted to go ahead and pick one of these up, I'll have a link in the description. So check that out. So let's go ahead and take this out of the box and uh, I'll tell you more about it. So I've been using this for about two weeks now and I can tell you that it, it truly does make a difference. I've noticed a difference in the amount of dust in my, in my room and it noticeably smells different. So just showing you that it comes with an instruction manual here. Okay, so now we've got it all open. Taking the front panel off, which is held on by two clips up top and magnets at bottom. I'm showing you here the clips and the magnets at the bottom. So let's go ahead and take this filter out. This is the first stage. The white part is the HEPA and the blue part is a mesh. It's for the larger particles. Taking out the second filter, the back is also for more larger particles and then the back, the black and white, is activated charcoal or carbon. That will help with uh, smell. So looking at the back, that's our intake fan right there and it takes it in there and blows it out the back. So going over the button layout, you have Ion Sleep Timing on the left, then on the right you have Power and Sleep. Looking at the manual, if you want you can go ahead and pause at any time to, to read these. Hopefully I got close enough. This is just giving you a brief overview of what it can do with the different parts of the filter. Showing you how to set up the filtration and if you need to replace it, how to do it properly. Then it talks about the colors up top there, the different color LEDs and what they mean. Green is excellent air. Blue is medium level air, and red is bad air. So it kind of kicks on and, and works depending on that if you leave it in auto mode. And then they do give you a warranty. I believe it's 12 months. So looking at the first layer of filtration, this is the activated carbon right here, and then the back of it and it goes in like I'm showing you with the activated carbon facing the inlet fan and it has a nice tab at the bottom there for you to pull it out. Doing the same with the HEPA filter and the large particle filter. Putting it in making sure that it's nice and snug all the way around. It is a tight fit and just showing you how nice it is with the tab there. Okay, so let's go ahead and plug it in and turn it on. So turning it on, you'll see initially it will start with red, meaning bad air. And then uh, you have your fan speed control then uh, so that's highest speed right there on the loudest setting it's really not that loud I'll go it's definitely uh, moving quite a bit of air so we'll just going back over the buttons there's the ion filtration which helps with smoke and ions. If you turn that off, then it'll just be through the filtration normally. As you can see, it switched to blue already. In the top right, that is your temperature. It's in Celsius. 
what I'm doing now is showing you the timing because you can set this up to I believe it's eight hours and then it will automatically shut off you can put it in sleep mode which is ultra quiet and then just putting it back on ion putting it on medium then high Overall, this has been a great filter, and uh, if you're looking for a HEPA filter but you don't want to break, break the bank, this is definitely a good way of getting into HEPA filtration, and overall, just a great filter. This has been Zach with Zach's Reviews. Hope you have a great day. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.